the G20 summit has given Osaka an opportunity to shine on the world stage. The economic capital of Kansai also boasts a rich cultural heritage that is about to be globally recognized. One of Japan's most ancient tombs may soon attract international attention. The mausoleum of Emperor Nintoku is one step away from becoming a World Heritage Site. It's the largest burial mound in the country. The tomb is a key part of two groups of 49 graves straddling three cities in the western Japan prefecture of Osaka. Japan is aiming to put the Mozu Furuichi tumulus clusters on UNESCO's World Heritage List. Local officials started campaigning toward that end 15 years ago. After three failed attempts to clear the domestic screening, the tombs finally got the nod from the Japanese government two years ago. A representative of ICOMOS, an advisory body to UNESCO, came to inspect the site last autumn. Then the Imperial Household Agency made a surprise move. The body, which oversees all 112 emperor's tombs in Japan, had a policy of keeping them strictly off-limits. But it started working with the local municipal government on excavating the grave of Emperor Nintoku. Sakai City has been surveying tombs that are not under the agency's jurisdiction and proactively sharing its findings with the organization. About a month into the joint project, journalists got their first ever chance to go inside the sacred tomb. Agency and local officials had dug three ditches on the embankment. Locals see the World Heritage listing as an opportunity to shine on the international stage. This newly opened store sells all kinds of goods related to ancient tombs. Visitors can also make clay figures like the ones found in burial mounds. Good news came in mid-May. モズ古市古墳群に着きまして、世界遺産委員会の諮問機関でありますイコモスが世界遺産に登録することが適当であるという旨評価したことがユネスコから通知されました。Sakai City's official mascot said words cannot express his excitement. A restaurant that has served curry with keyhole shaped rice for 10 years celebrated by doubling the toppings. UNESCO's final decision on the site's registration on the World Heritage List is expected at the end of June or in early July.